Hello everybody, I messed up the first one. We're grilling up some ribeyes, these are bone-in ribeyes. Uh, we'll just put them in right now. Uh, my son is over there breaking the tree, and nosy wife. So yeah, we're grilling them up right now, and I will show you guys how it looks after yeah. it's done cooking. Yeah. And crazy daughter's over here too. So we'll be back. So what's up everybody man? Uh still here. This might look like it take it might take a little bit. Pretty long time, you know, for it to cook up, man. These are pretty big bone in ribeyes. And uh see know. whenever you guys start seeing the fire like that flaming up, what you guys gotta do is make sure you close it up. You know what I mean? Close it down real quick. Yeah, you gotta let that fire calm down because or else it's gonna burn your meat. Say what up though, man. Say hi. Hi. Yeah, so. Okay, we'll be back. Alright, yo, what's up? It's been about maybe five minutes on this side right here. And, uh, you know what she gotta say. And, uh, we're gonna flip them up. Flip them over. We'll see how, how they look. Hi. I want that fat right there. I want that fat right there. Oh, look at that. Looks pretty nice, dude. Look at that. Can you hear that sizzle? <laughs> Can, you hear that bacon? Can you hear that steak sizzle? Look at that. That's nice, man. Oh, yeah. I love it. I love it. Let me close this down because the flames are flaming up. So we'll be back. What you got to say? Hi, bud. What's up? Look at the steaks, man. Those are humongous steaks, man. Wow. My son got a nice little bow cut. Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> it needs to be spiked up. Damn, man. Look at those. That should be on freaking uh, barbecue uh, masters. <laughs> wow. Mine, I don't know. I'll probably take this bad boy right here, though. This is probably Emmanuel's right here. Yeah, that's mine. Um, Still got more time. I'll be back. Yo, can you guys hear that steak sizzle? Ribeye, uh, bone ham ribeye. Man, that looks really, really uh, good. Uh, 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 okay, hold on. Let me close this up because the flames are flaming up, though. Well, I gotta move them around because I don't want them to uh, burn up. Yeah, see all this fat right here? That's the best. The fat is what gives the steak the flavor. We'll be back. Yo, so what's up? We're back. The steaks are taking a long time, man. They're taking a while to cook up. You know what I mean? Pretty big old steaks though, I gotta love it. Look at that baby. Listen to that steak sizzle. That. That's some good fat right there, man. Very good fat. And the way you guys could check the steaks, you know, you guys could just touch them like that. You know, this one's just still still a little bit rare. See how it goes down, it sinks in a little bit. It's rare. We're trying to cook them uh, medium well, you know, so. 
And the other method you guys could do it is uh, just get a knife, man. Like just cut it, you know, right in the middle. Because that's where all, you know, that's that's how you know your whole steak is done if you cut it right through the middle. So still got a lot of time for this, man. And you know what, man? I didn't even have any wood, you know. So what I did, I got, I found some of those uh, two by fours right there. I cut them up in pieces, just tossed them in there, you know. Put them, in, put them on fire, man. And there you go. Have your own little charcoal going on. If y'all don't want to go spend money in charcoal, you know what I'm saying? So I'm a cheap ass like that though. But we cheap like that though. Check out this steak. Oh, baby, look at that, though. It's nice. Look at this bone. See? Bone and ribeye, baby. You guys don't need no fancy ass grill either, man. Y'all could just do it on a regular little grill like me. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Alright y'all, so the steaks are done, man. Uh, Dad, look Dad, like Dad, medium, medium well. We're about to put some chicken Dad, up right I now. Record. Okay, come record. Nah. So we're about to put the chicken on. The chicken on. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Put it on top of the fire. I'm about to close it right now. Yeah. Okay, y'all, so we got the chicken in the grill, man. Steaks are delicious. What's up, y'all? This this chicken right here is going to take a while, man. Just barely put them, you know what I mean? They're going to take a long time to cook, though. So whatever you guys do, man, once you guys are handling chicken with the same, uh, with the same tongues or whatever, Make sure you don't handle anything else, like, because you don't want to, you don't want to cross-contaminate anything, you know. You guys could end up getting salmonella, you know what I'm saying? So, what up, yo? We're about to flip this suckers over. I know they're not ready yet, but the freaking fire keeps... It's burning up the skin, man. You know what I'm saying? Chicken. I hate I hate grilling chicken because it takes a while. It takes a long time, man. A little bit longer than the freaking ribeyes, though. And 
And this chicken right here is thigh meat, um, bone in thigh meat. You could do it boneless too, but I like it with the bone better. Can y'all hear that chicken sizzle? What are you doing, boy? Yeah, we'll be back, man. We'll be back. What up, yo? What up, yo? So, yeah, checking this chicken out. You know what I'm saying? It's starting to cook up. It might take a little bit longer. So you guys got to make sure it's cooked really good, man. Get under the skin. You see that? It's still raw. You see a little pink on it? That means it's raw still, you know what I'm saying? All right, boys, so uh, that should be it, man. My, I'm about to go eat my steak, you know what I'm saying, and some of this chicken. Um, chicken's not cooked all the way yet, but my phone, it's about to die. So I'll uh, leave it here. Y'all have a good day. I'm out.